Uh, one general admission ticket. Okay, everything is assigned seat for the men's game. Oh. We have 35 25 and $10 tickets. $10. All right, sir. Give, give me in the door. How are you? All right. Okay, and don't forget this up here. Um, keys. Body cam. Okay, that's that's what set this off. No, I just ran it through. Okay, I need you to go ahead and remove that so I can. The scanner went off on me, so I need to. You got your phone back on? Yeah, well, that's it. Okay. All right. Something's right here going off. What's that behind there? Knife. You won't be able to come in with the knife. Okay? So you're going to have to return the knife to your vehicle. No, thank you. Okay. Have a nice night, but you won't be able to come in I, with the I knife. I purchased a ticket. I'm ready to go. You will not be able to enter with the knife. Uh, what's your name? My name is Beverly, Beverly, and I'm the supervisor here. Okay. And it is the venue policy that knives is a prohibited item. You will not be able to enter in with the knife. Okay. You're in violation of state law. Oh, okay. No, nobody. Got it? Yep. Would you like to know the law you're violating? No, I don't need to. You do not need to know the law you're violating? Beverly to Carl Dean. Can you come to the venue here? The venue has the option to choose no, what they not. want to live here. It is here. not free in state law. Okay, that's all here, I can tell you. Here's the law right here. I'll give you a copy of the law. I'm aware of the law. Okay, Beverly, are you understand? You personally are going to be held civilly liable for the action you're taking right now. Okay. You're going to be sued yourself. That is fine. Okay. Do what you need you to do. You understand that. But... You will not, unless someone from OU tells me that you can enter in okay. with that knife, you will not be able to enter in. OU, OU cannot tell you to violate a law. Okay. He's going to be big, yeah. He's going to be big, yeah. He's going to be big, yeah. He has a pocket knife on him. I told him he cannot enter. He proceeded to tell me I'm violating law and that he's going to sue me. So I told him it's venue policy that he cannot mm -hmm. There's a copy of the law. The legislature. Uh, preempts all laws, including knives, and even on a college campus. This is what it, right here, and it also says no municipality or the political subdivision, which is what you are right here. So, and also it clearly states that the violation right here, and I will uh, have lawsuits going against her you, and if you approve her uh, action, I'm going to give you. Do you by chance have the body camera on right now? Yes. Okay. That is what he has the body camera on, so. That is fine. Okay. I'm going to, this is OU's call, not That mine. is. Yeah. Uh, it's your call. No, no, you're, 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 no, no, you're held, you will be held personally responsible. It is your call. What's your name, sir? Me too. I'm sorry, what's your name? I'm on the radio. You can oh, wait okay. just a minute. Sure. David, right? And you go to the south, the east law, uh, east coast south policy place. Would you let me show you more what you're violating? I understand, I understand what you're saying. Okay. Well, you're, it'll be a violation of state law. Well, that's absolutely yeah, no, it's it's No, it's going to be against you. Okay, it's not you I'm, not, I'm not stopping you. Okay, okay. what's your name? I'm Dean. Dean, what's your last name? What's your last name? John Spencer. Okay, what's your last name? I don't have to give it to you. Okay, uh, well, actually, you do. If you're violating my rights, yes, you do. I am not violating. I have not seen to stop you. It is. I have not even stopped you, sir. Well, wait. I'm just going to do it. Okay. So, Mike, can I proceed? I have a ticket. Can I proceed? Has it been scanned yet? I don't know. It does not. Has it been scanned yet? You can't proceed yet. Can I, can I scan it and proceed? Yes. Yeah. No, no, you go with this. The other one's going to deal with it. Okay. You do what they want. Okay. I want. Be advised, you've been warned. You I understand. understand. There's a copy of the law right here. I don't understand. Like a copy of it. No, I don't need it. I've seen it. Okay. You've seen the law, and you're yeah. still going to violate it. Yeah. It's, it's not my fault. You're call. awesome, guy. You're it's awesome. It's not my fault. And you're getting hurt in trouble, too. You can make this go away just by letting me go through and enjoy the game. This has been state law for a number of years. Good, I've just purchased a ticket and I would like to enter the game. Okay. Um, what's, it, what's the issue that we're having here? She has the issue of me. Okay, yeah, so 
What's, what's your name, sir? My name's Drake. Drake? Yes. Drake, what's your last name? Stenberg. Okay, Drake, here's a law stating this exact issue. The state hereby preempts all uh, laws and rules according to knives. which includes a college campus, clearly. And it also states it right here, it reiterates again that it's a political subdivision, which is the university. Now also this violation of my civil rights, me not being able to carry this knife, I will personally hold you, hold Beverly, and that gentleman right there will also be sued. You will be sued if I'm not allowed to enter tonight with the ticket I have purchased. Okay, so I have one other um, official that's on his way right now to address this. Um, you so, understand that you personally, you're personally going to have a liable in this. Okay. Uh, here's a copy of the law, take it with you. This law does not count for state institutions as the higher education. Yes, it does. No, it does not. So, here's a copy of it right here. Show me, where, show me where it says it does. That's not my job. Our okay. university attorneys have told us it's a university policy. We we have have a right here, the state premiums all fields, including knives, in any way. And right here, it says, no municipality or political subdivision, which is the state right here, will have any regulation or ordinance concerning the carrying, possession, carrying, transportation of knives. You do not preempt this. The state, but we do preempt no, this. As you look into it later, what's your name? Michael Byrne, Director of Event Management, sir. Director of Management? Okay. Yes, sir. Michael Byrne, you're going to be sued personally for this, and make sure you're advised if you understand that. So it's going to be sued, sue him, him, and you will be sued. Okay. Okay. Now, I have a ticket I purchased. I wish to enter. Okay. You can enter without a pocket knife. No, I wish to enter with my knife. My it's knife. Our, it is our right to refuse your service. If you want to enter with a pocket knife, you can't well, do anything about it because I'm going to enter. If you enter, then you are now trespassing, and we'll ask the police to escort you out. Okay, what police? Because I don't see any. We'll bring OUPD over here, and they'll escort you out. It's a venue policy. We do not allow weapons. Okay, can you time. understand that they'll also be sued, so you're dragging that that officers will be sued in the too. Do you understand that? Yeah. And your name is what again? Michael Byrne. Michael Byrne. Okay. Yes, so I want you to have a copy of this because this I is what you're going to You have a copy yes, of it? Can you, all right. I'm not leaving. I have my knife. I'm going to go to my, my ticket. Can you show me where my seat is? I won't do that. We'll get the police officers. You're not going to come in with the knife. Okay. The police officers are going to escort me to my seat. That's fine. They're not going to escort you to my seat. That's a policy. We ask you if you would please take it back. Yeah. Yeah. I don't understand. The policy is against the law. The so policy it is not it's against the law. Right here. Right here. It's unlawful. Right 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 can you read? Right yes, sir. I can. Okay. Yes, right there, it says it's preempted. So how can the state, how, how can the university preempt the state when it's The preempted? university, higher education, and public schools do not. No, public schools are two separate things. It's right here. It's just specifically school property. It was defined as an elementary or secondary school. That is not higher education. You need to read this because you're going to be sued. You're going to be sued, and all these people are going to ask you to take it back to your car. I'm not doing that. If you don't want to do that, then we're going to ask you to leave, sir. I'm not leaving. I'm not leaving, so uh, I'd like to go to my seat now at this time. I'm sorry, but unfortunately, you're not allowed in the venue with weapons of any kind. I don't have a weapon, I have a knife. Okay, may I see your knife? Okay. If I remove my knife, it is not a hostile act. I agree. I agree. I would, just like, I I would just like to see the knife. Okay. okay, so it's just a folding pocket knife. Correct. Okay. Do you have a need to have it in the bed? Doesn't matter. Okay. It does matter because we do not allow knives in the building. It counts as a weapon. We do not allow weapons. It's, it's a, I've got a poster. There's no issue here. We have to bring a gun in its holster. It's still a weapon. In the state, and the, the university can prohibit a firearm that specifically says so right here. Correct. And we can prohibit weapons. No, it cannot be prohibited a knife. It cannot. Okay. We've been told that. walk in with a building knife and you can't do a thing about it either. Actually, we can. No, it's our inner policy. You cannot. It's right here. It's right here. It's so specifically, the knives, have, knives have been repealed out of the unlawful carry. Again, we need to read the law. We've been told by our by our administration that we are not allowed to allow that. Do you understand? Did they tell you you will be sued personally because it says right here you will be sued personally? Right here. 
it says, when a person's right for sense of protection that have been preempted, which is what's going on right now, that I can sue the municipality, the persons, that's you, municipality of political subdivisions about civil and justice. So I'm going to sue the university and you if the university says what you're talking about. Right. So if you understand, like it's perfect to put, you're going to be sued for it. Okay? Okay. So yeah, where's, where's my station? Where's my station? Okay, it doesn't matter. matter. It does matter. If you, look, if you try to tell me that you're not going to have a policy of life transgender in here, and they tell you that's what it's going to be, are you going to enforce that? So if I'm going to enforce that, it's my job to enforce the policies, and I'm asking if you would please just return it back to your phone. No, I'm not. I'm, I'm in my seat. I'd like to sit down now. I'm sorry. Scam me. Scam me. Let me in, please. I'm sorry. He won't let me. I can't. I'm asking you to return it back to your seat. I have a ticket. I'm sorry. Scan. If he tells me we cannot scan it, I cannot scan okay, it. You're understanding. You're going to be held liable for this. Go right ahead. What's your name, I'm following my boss's rules. Right there's my name. Sure, George. Yes, sir. You're, you're denied entry. Denied entry. If you're coming, my George is coming. Okay, I'm going in. I have a ticket. I'm peacefully in. I'm going in. You're not allowed to enter with the message. I can get you right over here. I can't scan your ticket. Okay. I know, babe. It's all right. If you will wait, please don't forget. I'll wait on you. I will call our university attorney and I will double check. You want to take this with you? We've all seen a copy of it. Okay. Apparently not. Okay. 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 Appreciate your patience. Sure. I have gotten the clear to bring in. Thank you. Yes. Scan it? Yes. Okay. There you go, sir. Okay. Mm -hmm. well, I didn't hear you. That's it. That's not you. You go out the other road. That's not you. Yeah, I'm the president of the Oklahoma Second Amendment Association. Yeah. And these little things like this, is, it's absolutely stupid a person can't have a knife in their pocket. It's just, and they're sending people back to their cars, and it's, some of them, are, one of them is one of their members, and he's a veteran, uh, combat wounded, and for him to let back to his car on a rainy night is absolutely insulting. So this is what we do is we have you gone to Fort Chesapeake yet? Uh yes. This is all in Jay. Thank you.